Today, this film is going to help explain to you how to choose the right road bike. The first thing to determine is what are your motivations. Are you simply looking to ride to work or to keep fit, or are you a performer or an out and out racer? What's very important about the road bike is the geometry, the frame and the forks. This will determine how the bike handles. Is it a lower down position for speed and more pace, or a more upright position for more comfort and control? The materials used vary a great deal as well, from aluminium through to carbon fibre. If you're just getting into road cycling, we recommend looking at an aluminium frame bike. Aluminium is very durable, strong and lightweight, but still comfortable to ride. It's also not too expensive, which is very important if you're starting out in the sport. Aluminium bikes also tend to have quite a lot of clearance around the tyres, and this gives you the possibility of adding in a full mudguard and pannier racks. Very practical if you're thinking about cycling to work or doing some cycle touring. If, however, your goal is performance and speed, we often recommend that you look at the carbon fiber frame bike. Why carbon fiber? Well, it's lighter than aluminium, it's more responsive, it can be stiffer as well, which gives more performance, but without the comfort sacrifices. This does come at a cost, however, and carbon fiber does tend to be more expensive than the aluminium bikes. Saying that, you can also find some very good, high quality aluminium bikes which have been very well designed, which can actually leave some poor quality carbon bikes for dust, so don't rule them out. Ultimately, whichever bike you choose, in particular carbon fiber, the cost does tend to increase. However, this can be offset by the gains in performance and speed, allowing you to increase your performance in sporties or road racing. The final point to remember is that the further up the ranges you go, you tend to find an increase in level of componentry as well, not just in the frame, such as the gearing, the brakes, but also in wheels, in the saddle, the seat post, the bars and the stem. Of course, again, it's a case of less is more. So the more you spend, the less weight you get, but you get more performance. This you need to offset when buying your bike. What's very important to remember is that if you don't have the budget initially, if you start off with a good quality frame, you can always upgrade these components as you progress into road cycling. Thank you.